Hi everyone, welcome back again. I'm Grace and you're still watching Filipino Lipstick with uh, I'm still here at Ayala Mall Center Cebu guys with this beautiful lady. We'll be having an interview vlog with them today. So let's get to know them. So what's your name girl? Hello everyone, I'm Jihazel. Jihazel. So Hazel, I can call you Hazel for short. What about you? Hello everyone, my name is Rachel May Verbal. Rachel, Rachel and Hazel, how old are you guys? I'm 21. 20, 20, 30, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 21. 21 this year. So I'm 20 this year. Oh, 20. 20 this year. So are you guys working or student? Student. Full time student. Full time student. You never tried working? Not yet. Not yet. Like working student? Never tried. So how are you guys doing today? Well, I'm, uh, I've seen you at Ayala Mall, right? Walk around. So how, how is it? Well, it's good. It's good. So are you guys Anaman, um, from school? Just came out from school or yes. are you going to school? Just um, came, just came, came out from school, yes. so your time would be like half the day. Yes. Okay. So, um, are you living in the province or in the city? You. Please. Currently living in the city. Are you a province girl? Yes. Okay. What province are you? In um, Borbon. Borbon. So that's north part of Cebu. Okay. What about you? Cebu City. So you're a city girl. So this is a province girl. This is a city girls guys. So I'm sure you guys know that. A lot, a lot of question on Monday asked also, what's the difference between a province girl and a city girl? You know? What's the difference of your lifestyle there? So how's your uh, life going on in the province? Um, actually, I, I am living, I'm still living with my parents. So I'm in our house doing household chores and um, people mostly they said that mostly people in the province are farmers so um we we don't have farm farm ah, okay so what's your family do for a living by the way my father is just a construction worker ah, okay. well my mother is a housekeeper so how many uh, siblings do you have we are four in four. in the family Six, uh, six in our family. Six in the family together with the siblings. We have four, including you. What about you? What's your family do for a living? Well, my mother, is, she's working in a barangay. Oh, so a official, uh, barangay like a government official? official. Yes. Okay. So and my father is a tricycle driver. Tricycle driver. So, um, how many siblings do you have? I have five. I have two sisters in my mother's side and I have oh, so two you have brother brother. my... Oh, so you have brother. Yes. sisters. Yes. Okay. But that's good to hear. So how's your study going on right now, being a student? Well, it is hard, especially it is, hard. is, you know, that it is hard to just like a Because you'll be, uh, how many years in college you need to finish? What's your course, by the way? Um, Bachelor of Science in Management Accounting. Management Accounting. That's a hard uh, course for me. Yes, and my it sister is, is also the same thing. Yes. Same course with you and she's almost graduated right now. So that's hard. Yes. Me, it's really hard, especially is pag graduab na ko is came to sa humanities and humanities. Yes. Oh, okay. So you you've been ano man studying them since before then K twelve the bus school. Yes. So we didn't experience that before since we only have K twelve uh, latest right now, right? So what about you? How's the study going on? We're we're the same because we're classmates. Oh, you're classmates. Okay, same school. Yes. Same school. So same of course. Yes. You have same. Course. Yes. Why do you guys love accounting? <laughs> you love numbers. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> you're, you're smart in math. Because I think usually no. people accounting, <laughs> they love mathematics. <laughs> no? no? Okay. Are you guys single or taken? Single. Single. For how long? You? Four years. At <laughs> least <laughs> four years. You've been single for four years? Yes. How about you? Since birth. Since birth. Wow. But you are older than her, right? Because you're turning yes, 21. Yes. And you've been single for four years? Yeah, maybe. Are you ready to mingle again if the right man will come? No, not yet. Not yet. Yeah. So soon, someday? Yeah. Okay, so are you After focusing your on your study? You have yes. priorities in life? Yes. Oh, that's good to hear, guys. Oh, so what's your I know, man, um, uh, ideal guy? For me, is. Well, no? no. <laughs> I mean, like, it depends. It, it depends. depends. At the right time. Right? The right time. So yes. you, can, you cannot tell right now. Only yes. the right time will tell. Okay, what about you? The ideal man? Yeah, ideal man. Um, of course, kanang, he, he truly loves me. He, he's your intentions. That's I'm sure he's... all girls naman have the same personality they want for a guy that you love. A guy that's kind, honest, and also they love Iba. They love us and the way we love them. Right? So, um, next would be... Um, What's your ideal first date? I'm sure all the girls have their ideal first date. 
a man. First date. Yeah. Do you like a beach date or a movie date I or would, a sports? I would prefer um, we're in a place like in nature. Nature. So you want a mountain type? Mountain. Oh. Like hiking, you like hiking. Yes, hiking. So you want a guy the same vibes with you, like like yes. life hiking also. <laughs> what about you? Beach. Beach. So she loves romantic dinner. Yeah. Yeah, like yeah. a dinner date on the beach. Yes. I think most of us love it because I also love dinner date on the beach compared to sports or other things like movies. It's boring for me, right? Mm -hmm. So this would be the the first question. Uh, the last question actually, but you're not you're not supposed to answer right now. Yeah. So you either choose a sex or chocolate. But that would be the last question, okay? The first one will be, uh, would you prefer a uh, foreigner or Filipino and why? To you, Hazel. I would prefer Filipino. Filipino. Because you know that we have different culture with the foreigners. Yes. Oh, and it's it? easy to communicate with him. Yeah, I do agree, of to course. get the vibes that you wanted to have. Yeah, what, what about you? Foreigner. <laughs> foreigner, oh my gosh. You guys are friends, but you, you love foreigner better. You would choose foreigner and why? Um, I choose foreigner because Challenging. Challenging. Yes. You want to adopt your culture also? You have different culture with us, yes, right? Yes, yes, it's okay. It's okay with you. Yes. <laughs> you would adjust the culture. Yes. <laughs> but those foreigners, uh, the Western people don't eat rice. Is it okay with you? <laughs> I can cook on my own. <laughs> <laughs> you can cook on your own. That's a good answer. Anyway, um, uh, would you prefer cuddle or kissing? You, Hazel. Cuddle. Cuddle. You're a cuddle yes. person. You love to hug all the time. Yes. Okay, what about you? Cuddle. Cuddle, cuddle also. Yes. Compared to kissing. <laughs> you don't want an intimate moment. You only want like a comforting one. Yes. Because cuddle would make you comfort, right? Okay. Is it personality matters? And why? Yes, of course. And why is it? Because you you will not get you'll not get um communicate that what about the physical appearance? Is it matters also for a guy? For me? Yeah, for you. What about you? It, it still matters. So, but the most important is the personality. Yes, the personality still wins. Oh, it still wins compared to a um, physical appearance. What about you? Rachel? Personality. Personality, of course. What yes. about the physical appearance? Mm, yeah. Part of it. Part of it. Yeah. Is it a bonus also for girls that they yeah. also want that as part of the relationship that they want also a guy that has a good looking? Um, it does. It does not matter, but but you know when you date someone like you should wear like like formal or like like you so they good looking. Yes. Like the good look. Yeah, for good looking guy. Anyway, um, would you prefer money or love? And why? So you hate either. Love, love over money. Love. And why you choose love? Because we can find money, and love is is it is is hard to it's find. Hard to find. Yes. So you guys are not practical girls. What about you? Maybe you are. Both. Both. Yes. <laughs> you can answer both. Because love, because we know that we really need love, and money, of course, because. I think we nowadays, always, yeah. Yeah, I think, we use that every day. Yeah, I think know? we need money yes. nowadays, yes. isn't it? Because most yes. of us girls, they're also practically speaking, they want the money instead of love. Yeah. Nowadays, for younger generations like you guys, right? Yes. So you guys also want to earn a good money for you and then uh, at the same time love. Yes. At the same time love, okay. Uh, would you prefer, um, would you date a guy that has a mustache or beard on the face? Yeah, either half beard or you know, bigote. So would you date a guy like that? What about your ratio? No, <laughs> no, it's not the type of guy you like. Yes, I don't like. <laughs> Why is this? I don't know what. Like, I really don't like. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't look old for to have a mustache. I, I don't know, but I don't when know I look them, not my type. Not you. I you don't find the same as you, so you don't like it. You don't want to date a guy like that. Even though they're handsome. <laughs> so for you, it they're depends. Not, I depends. <laughs> Yeah. And I think see, I've seen a lot of guys come out that are handsome with the beard. Like half of them, not, not full beard like Santa Claus has. Oh, yeah. So probably half of it. Okay, um, would you date a guy that has fat belly? What about the fat guy? Would you date with them? You, Hazel? It still depends. It still depends. So for you guys, it doesn't matter if they're fat or not. What about you? It still depends because if you're in love that person, you should accept. Yeah, I do agree with that. Yes. So either he's fat or not, the best. 
So uh, what about the guy that smokes? Would you date a guy like that? Smoking occasionally. What if occasionally, occasionally. they smoke? Yeah, occasionally. Would you date a guy like that? If it's occasionally, it's okay for me. It's okay for you. So what about you? Same as her. Same as her. Some of the girls I've asked them, they don't like a guy that smokes. They hate cigarettes or they hate a smoking guy. Well, if they smoke in a proper place, yes. ah, okay. Maybe that would be a, a good also. But for me, I don't. It, it's a no for me. Yeah. It's not the <laughs> type of guy that I like. That I, like with. I don't like smoking. Even me, I don't want to smell it. Anyway, uh, would you go out with a vegetarian guy? For example, they are vegetarian. They always love eat vegetables all the time during your day. Would you date a guy yes. like that? Yes, okay. for you? I uh, Because you live in a province, right? Mostly vegetables. Yes. What about you? It's okay for me, even though I'm not a vegetarian. See, you're a meat lover. Yeah. Also, you're a meat lover. Yeah. Uh, but it's okay for you guys. Yes, Have yes. different food in the table. Yeah, it's okay. Well, that's good to hear. Anyway, um, this is also a common ask questions, girls. Um, is it age does matter for you? Or does it matter? It does not matter. So what's your age preference, like age gap? Um, I think one year older. Or... One year older than you. So what about you? Age doesn't matter. Well, five years. Five years and age ah, gap. Okay, five preference. years age gap. Preference, the right? best. That's good to hear, girls. Um, so would you choose, this one also is a common ask question. So would you go out with a young guy that visit the Philippines but needs to go back to his to go to work or the old guy that lives in the Philippines with a retirement pension. Which one would you choose or prefer? Hazel. Young guy. The young guy. As um, long as he's he's older than me. Okay, so what about you? Yeah. For me is as long as he is older than me then he you know, if he love me like like communication. Yes, communication. So you guys are okay with the long distance relationship? Because yes. he needs to go back to yes. US for work. It's okay for you. It's okay for you. Yes. So anyway, does it matter, girl? Anyway. Oh, that's a good question. Uh, do you believe you're a good kisser, girl? What about you? You can well, you can rate that from 1 to 10. 1 is the lowest and 10 is the highest. Um, I don't have experience, but I think, I I think. I'll give myself 8. <laughs> <laughs> maybe that's good enough. And what about you? Also, like her, I don't have any experience, but maybe five. Five? <laughs> Not bad. I think girls, you need more practice. Because <laughs> she's better. <laughs> eight. Really? Yeah. Really? A promise girl has eight and uh, you're five. five. I'm not sure. City girl. Maybe that's the differences between the two, right? <laughs> maybe yeah. in the promise yes. city. <laughs> Anyways, um, have you dated a foreigner before? Not even once. Both of you Foreigner? Yeah. Online. Online. Yes. So you tried, uh, have you tried using dating app? No. Only you? No, I mean um, Instagram. Instagram. Yeah. So you dated him for how long? Like, it depends months, the next month. Like that. So that you, kind of yeah, that was before, right? <laughs> yes, it's your past before. experience. Okay. Uh, would you prefer a long term relationship or a short term one? A long term. Long, long term. term. And yes. why do you choose long term? Because I will date or marry. Uh, you I don't, don't want a, a funny one thing, so you want a serious one, relationship. Yes. What about you? Um, a funny one and a serious one. Wow, both? Yes. You can have both a short term and a long term. Yes. She's an open minded girl, isn't it? Yeah. And why is it? Is it because you don't want to get more serious nowadays or what? Like, it depends. Most of the time, serious, like, I want him to be serious and sometimes, like, a funny one. Ah, okay. <laughs> so if we broke up, it's fine with you for a short term relationship. Well, it hurts, but. It hurts. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay, anyways. Um, would you live in a house or in a condo? Which in one? A house. And why is it you choose house? Because I want a permanent. Permanent. So you want. Uh, it feels like it's home? Yes. So you feel like home for it instead of condo? Yes. What about it's more you? Comfortable. A house. Too. A comfortable, yeah. I don't because think. I can do everything I want in the house. like. Compared uh, to Hondo? Yes. Okay, it's really comfortable. Yeah, okay. So this one is interesting also. Would you choose lights on or lights off? <laughs> Hazel. <laughs> lights off. Lights off. So you all about you? Lights off. Lights off. So you both girls are conservative also, right? I think most yes, nights are yes, that way. Yeah. Yes. I think most girls nowadays, I've seen, they also like lights off. They're comfortable with. Yes. Over to lights on. <laughs> Anyways, um... Is it size matter or performance matter in a relationship? For example, if you choose one, if you choose one, or you can choose both. So, which one? <laughs> is it size matter or performance matter? Performance. Performance matter. What about you? Both. Both? <laughs> I think she loves both all the time. So, 
so both sizes and performance, yes, guys. <laughs> Anyways, this will be my last question. Actually, what would that be that I asked you earlier? Mm -hmm. what, what was the question that I've asked? <laughs> It's supposed to be the last questions right now before we end this video. <laughs> Six or chocolate? Chocolate. Chocolate. So what about you? <laughs> chocolate for now. Ah, uh, for now. Okay. So what kind of chocolate, girls? Uh, dark or milk? Dark. Dark, dark chocolate. Dark. So you both have live yeah. dark chocolate. But for now, girls. Yes, for now. <laughs> for Soon, now. Yeah. Both. Oh, we're both. Okay. That's good answer, girls. Anyway, I have a a good conversation with you guys and thank you also for accepting my invitation and before we end this video guys i hope you enjoyed this video and also don't forget to subscribe and click that notification bell for more updates see you next vlog bye